These other expenses that are not considered ingredients, these expenses are called operating expenses or OPEX for short. That's O-P-E-X. So when people at your company talk about overhead, this is part of the income statement that they're referring to. With operating expenses, we're answering the question, how much did the company spend running the business? Some companies put all the operating expenses into one line item, but because Apple has a lot of research and development, they choose to itemize and break out that line separately here. And sometimes this is abbreviated as R&D. Research and development for Apple in 2018 was $14,236,000,000. This includes all the cost and spending for things like designing and improving existing products or inventing new products, and all these costs are completely independent of how much product is sold. So salaries of employees working on new products is an example of a research and development expense. Apple spent $16,705,000,000 on selling, general, and administrative. You'll likely hear this expense referred to as SG&A for short. It includes payroll expenses like the CEO and other executive salaries, but it also includes non-payroll expenses like office supplies, rent, marketing. These costs are generally fixed, meaning they don't vary directly with sales volume. So if Apple sells another product and they're able to increase revenue, operating expenses may not change at all.